What's going on, y'all? Second day in, um, I guess, first full day in Tokyo? I don't know. First full day, second day, whatever. I'm in the hotel room. I would have given you a tour, but I've already messed the room up. It's already dirty, so I don't know if a tour is going to be what's up. And then I was on Do Not Disturb for the room because we need a day to get your thoughts together and stuff, you know? Um, jet lag and whatnot. You can't just land and hit the streets. You be somewhat leaned over. Speaking of lean, this weather is leaning too. Look at it. Look how bad this weather is. I am. You know, Tokyo, everywhere you go in Tokyo, it's a um, high rise. So it's real bad weather today. Yesterday, it won't clear up until tomorrow. So, which is cool because I got some admin work I need to get done anyway. So, I need to be hopping on that kind of work, so I might as well do that. But um, 7-Eleven is a vibe in Tokyo. I'm sorry. It really is. It's not the same as the States. Um, it's very different. So uh, I went to 7-Eleven this morning, and I didn't take the camera. I should have, but I didn't. So this is really my third trip to 7-Eleven. Not my second, but whatever. I'm going to go to a different one today because I think, um, I don't know if they restocked at the one that's across the street. So they're every, pretty much on almost every corner. So let's go. Um, I won't be vlogging in the street because it's raining, as you can see. But uh, if I cut this right, the next scene, the next clip will be in 7-Eleven. Let's go. All right. I was going to the uh, other 7-Eleven, um, but... The um, the rain got me. It's cold and <laughs> rainy, and I am not here for it. So we are gonna be at our normal one, and we just gonna make it do what it do over here. Okay, now, yes, it's cold. Okay, I'm not prepared for this after being in the south of the United States for so long. All right, I think it's gonna warm up a little bit tomorrow, but right now it's freezing. Thank you. Okay. Now, I saw this girl talk about these yogurt drinks. She said they're so good. She said she just loves them. So I have the orange one, and I'll also get the strawberry one. Oh, and I've since learned, put everything in a cart here. Okay, and then you have like a little basket. All right, what else? Shall we get or try that is new? They have bamboo shoots, pickled onions, potato salad, egg salad, aged cod roll potato salad. <laughs> okay, all right, okay. This is shrimp with chili sauce. Shrimp with chili sauce? And it looks amazing. There's also a sweet stew diced pork. They got everything. Beef curry, hamburger steak. I bet it's good too. I'm gonna try something. Let's figure out what are we gonna try. They got fish, salty, grilled mackerel. This is grilled sable fish, which is black cod. Mackerel, red perch boiled in soy sauce. And they got all the things. Grilled fatty pork, grilled pork meatballs, smoked pork liver. Meatballs. Uh, let's see. I was about to speak, but I'm looking at them like they may not be an English child. Um, this is, oh, radish kimchi. Chicken salad. Okay, I am going to grab, oh, I'm not showing you nothing, am I? Okay, look, sorry. They have chicken bars and grilled chickens and smoked chicken and everything for salad, which is great. But I'm gonna tell you what I am gonna be trying. Um, it's these noodle salads right here. 
are absolutely divine. They're cold and you eat them cold. And I was in love. I was like, I ain't gonna like these. These are not gonna be good, but they are delicious. I just make sure this, see this is the one that got um, eggs in it. I don't want that one. Look at this one. Shrimp, shisho, garlic, and chili pepper. Maybe we'll switch it up and get a new for one. Look at this, they have ramens. Look at that one. All right, I think this looks good. Cold soy sauce ramen with pork, bean sprouts, and mustard greens, right? When in Rome, or uh, when in Japan, Tokyo. All right, uh, let's see what else we're gonna get. So we have yogurt drink, we got cold ramen. Oh, you can't see me, sorry. Yogurt drink, we've also got cold ramen. Oh, here's, they have this pasta salad. This is what I tasted earlier and fell in love with. It's a pasta salad with pork, vegetables, and sesame dressing. Shit is outstanding. I was like, I'm not gonna like this, you know, cause it's salad, but come to find out, I loved it. I thought it was outstanding. They got some Italian stuff down here. It don't look that Italian, but they got it down here. They have all kinds of stuff. Stuff you would never think of in a 7-Eleven. Who comes to 7-Eleven for this? Child us. Look at this. All the vegetables, they have fresh vegetables. You cannot talk about octopus, broccoli, and basil salad. Okay, octopus, broccoli, and basil salad. This one is a macaroni, bacon, vegetables, and mayonnaise. Oh, it's like a pasta salad. Well, well, come on, let's see if they got it right. Might as well get one of those. Okay, they have all the sandwiches. There's a BLT, bacon, lettuce, tomato, mustard. Oh, pork, ham, and cucumber. Pork, ham, cheese, lettuce. Okay, why don't we try, okay, look, there's a bacon, oh, the bread is so soft, right? Bacon, lettuce, tomato, mustard. Y'all keep saying it's no, um, it's no thin Japanese, I mean, it's no big Japanese people here, do you? I keep telling y'all, they out here. They getting all the snacks too, big in their back. All right, all right, now, on these little situations here, I have fallen in love with these little things. So tuna mayonnaise, this one is made from spicy pollock roe, spicy pollock roe, kelp and soy sauce, kelp and soy sauce, beef and sweet soy sauce, this one. Amazing, I'm getting the last two of them, all right. Oh, 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 I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, they have all the breads. And the breads look amazing, right? Look at all the breads. They have all the breads with all the jams. I don't know what this is. Since 1942. Oh, peanut butter. And jam. Peanut butter and jam. And look, they have donuts, cheese and bacon bread. Look, there's a Danish, there's a Danish bread slice, minced chicken cutlet, curry bread, sweet and spicy fried chicken. I mean, everything is just sitting out, I guess. Look at this one, pork, ham, cheese, and mayonnaise. Why would that be bad? I got enough in my basket. <laughs> 
Now, the one thing that I did also fall in love with while I've been here, they have these like jello, fruit jello jelly things. I don't know what they're called. These things here are dangerously addictive. So this one, I don't even know what flavor this is, but it looks like it's got some stuff going on. And I had this one earlier, which I thought was delicious. It's like the orange mandarin one. It was so good. And they have everything else you can sit up here and try. Yogurts and Greek yogurts and whatnot. You know, it's not too bad. They even have liquor if you want, you know, liquor in the whole bit. Candy and chips are also a thing here, right? So they have some potato chips, lightly salted, whatever the case might be. Look at that, cheese corn snacks. Oh, they got stuff though. Soy sauce rice crackers. I don't think we need any of those, do you? Soy sauce rice crackers, salty rice crackers. Yeah, we're okay on those. Cheese corn snacks. Yeah, we're okay on those. We think we got enough to play around with, don't we? I love they have all the, the dried ramen. They have so many flavors, Chinese spicy something and seafood noodles and soy sauce noodles and, but I've got a soup in the refrigerator at, at the house, at the hotel. And honestly, this is plenty of crapola. Look, they even have soups in a thing. Look at this, this is crazy. Look, they have so many in, with yuzu citrus, right? Rice soup with salmon. I mean, it's just, it's just so interesting. Don't you find this to be such an interesting operation? <laughs> I find this to be just so, so interesting. When you look around, look at the Listerine. Is that, what does that say? Does that say zero, um, zero alcohol? We don't know. Look, strong energy mint for your toothpaste. Okay, it's lion. They have all kinds of stuff here. And I'm here for it all, okay? I'm here for it all. All right, let's grab a drink, another tea, and let's get up out of here and go taste some of this stuff. Um, all right, I have killed the lemon tea and peach tea situation. This orange one I had earlier was delicious, but why don't we try, I don't know if this is milk or tea. Let's look at it, let's do our Google, um, what do you call that, translate? And let's see, camera, what's, what is this? What's going on here? It's strawberry, oh, lactic acid, oh, it's something, um, yeah, no, it's something milky. Okay, so we'll stick with uh, the teas. There's gotta be another tea spot somewhere over here. Something else has gotta have tea, right? Let's see what else we could, we can, oh, this says lemon salad. 30%, what is a lemon salad? It, no, it really says, say, hold on, I'm gonna put the thing up here first. Lemon salad. Thirty percent off car oh carbohydrates. Thirty percent less carbohydrates. It does. It says lemon salad. See, I don't know what lemon salad is, but I would be remiss in my duties as a content creator if I didn't get it. So I don't know what lemon salad is, but we are going to go find out in a little bit what a lemon salad is. Okay. 
All right, lemon salad. I don't want a smoothie. I wanted a tea. Okay, it's gotta be some more tea. It's gotta be somewhere over here, right? What is this? Is this tea? I think we found it. I can't read it though. Google to the rescue. This says afternoon tea. This says that tea. It's that, I am that tea, okay? Afternoon tea, delicious, sugar-free. Well, I don't mind the sugar. It says uh, afternoon tea, hot is not applicable. It got a lemon and a mint on the front. That's universal for Southern sweet tea, right? Let's grab it. Only one way to find out if we like it. All right, only one way to find out if we like it. All right, I think we better go. Come on, let's go run all this through. Um, oh, we need an ice, a thing of ice, don't we? Yesterday I grabbed the wrong thing. I grabbed the wrong ice. I should have grabbed a cup of ice and I grabbed the uh, ice for the ice latte and they charged me for the ice latte. And I was like, oh, my bad. I should have grabbed one of these. But guess what? <sighs> now we know. Hello. Bag, yeah. All right, let's see what this is all going to cost me. Something we can't even understand. So what I do is I have a converter app. that tells me, so I have a converter app. So he'll ring this up. It all comes out to 3107, which is $20 and 53 cents in United States dollars. So not terribly bad. Um, I think we can do Apple Pay here. We can, so we tap Apple Pay. Uh-oh. What's with the pay? Oh, wait, there it goes. Oh, okay, there it goes. Apple Pay. It doesn't work. I'll give you my card. All right, we're screwing stuff up around here, so let's just old fashioned tap with a credit card. All right, that sounds good. Went through this time. All right, 20 bucks. It's cold outside, so uh, I'll catch you back in the room. Made it back to the room with all the goodies. All right, I've got the tea. All right, I also picked up the bacon, lettuce, and tomato sandwich because these are divine. I picked up two of um, these rice balls with beef inside of them. My ice, my 7-Eleven baby shower pasta salad. Um, we'll see what that's hitting on. I picked up the pasta salad with the pork and the vegetables, which is one of my new all-time favorites with the sesame dressing that I didn't think I was gonna like, but loved. This is a 
cold soy sauce ramen. I think you're supposed to eat this cold. Yeah, you're supposed to, because if it was warm, it would come with something different. So this is the cold soy sauce ramen. I might save that for later, because that's going to be a nice treat for dinner. This is the... It says lemon salad. And I thought it was like juice. I don't hear nothing shaking. It's like solid inside. Or maybe it's just the air is compressed. Okay, these are the strawberry yogurt drink and the... Uh, Onshu Mikan yogurt drink, which I think is something about Mandarin or something. Some kind of orange, something or other. Also, I got the jellies. This one, I don't even know what this one is called. I should find, let me see if I could. Let's figure this out with Google Translate because I really don't know. Um, let's see. This says... Some stuff I can't pronounce. Something summer? Something or other? Yeah, I don't even know what this is. Take a photo of the words to translate. Yeah, I call myself translating this, but it doesn't, I don't know. Uses sweet summer something. Child, it just says sweet summer. So maybe sweet summer is a thing, right? And this one is delicious with pulp. It says garato. Yeah, so this didn't get us any closer. But nevertheless, let's go. All right, this is the lemon ensalada salad. I guess you drink it? I'm, I'm nervous. Okay, the arrow points this way. Let's see. Oh, look at that straw, it's so interesting. So, this part comes up and down and this part shakes. So maybe this is like the reinforcement part. You know, they do things so different here. We should do this back in the States. Okay, it's juice. I put the air in it and it started moving, so let's see. That's disgusting. It tastes like a knockoff lemonade. Yeah, no, I don't like it. I don't like that. Nope. It tastes like a, like a knockoff lemonade. Like, um, it's not good. So lemon salad translates to we don't like it. Okay. Another straw. Must be their patented straw design. It comes out like this. And I guess you do one of these numbers. Oh, wait. Let's go, let's translate it first. Um, functional food, balanced diet, drinkable yogurt. That's what it is called, a drinkable yogurt. Oh, it's yogurt and drinkable. It tastes like Dannon yogurt with a slight aftertaste, with bits of fruit running around. If you don't like the pulp, you don't want like that because it's got pulp in it. And then this one is the orange, I guess, that we that we couldn't, um, I can't read. Mm. Yeah, it's yogurt. Tastes like almost like a, like a lassi, if you will. It's delicious. Okay, rock ice glass. I don't know what rock ice is. But I think it's designed to keep your drink cold. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, oh. They make it easy. They make it easy for you. You know, these people have thought of everything. Let's see if there's any special instructions on here. You're supposed to shake it or something. I ain't no telling. It just says rock ice, name made with mineral water. That's it. So it's just ice. Does it, what makes it taste something? I mean, does it taste different? Does it taste like ice? Let's see. Is it from the Himalaya?
Mm. Tastes like ice chow. Let's try this lemon something or other. I don't even know what this is. Well, let's 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 see if this can tell us. I think it told me one time what it was. Afternoon tea. It's afternoon lemon tea. Let's see if it's sweetened at all. How close to Starbucks are we? Mm, smells like lemon. Smells very lemony. Oh, that's delicious. Mmm. That is tasty. Okay. Lemon tea. So far, so good. All right. I feel like I'm getting full. You know, you know, this the stuff, the sleeve stuff. Let's try this 7-Eleven deli cup of macaroni, bacon, vegetables, and mayonnaise. Oh, it smells good. It smells divine, actually. <laughs> mm, and it tastes pretty awesome. Um, that is delicious. Mm. You know what I want in this? I just want some peas and cubes of cheese. Oh, hey. mm, this is delicious, yeah. Who knew? Oh, this is good, y'all. Yeah. Hold on one second. Okay? All right, this is delicious. Okay. Let's try the bacon, lettuce, tomato, and mustard sauce. I will tell you, the bread is like soft. And when I say soft, I mean like soft, soft. Well, how do you, there you go. Oh, and it's crustless bread. That's smart. See that? Right, and then on the inside, it's like a few pieces of like ham-ish, bacon-ish looking stuff. All right, let's see if we like this. It's a ham sandwich. Nothing super amazing. And nothing bad about it. It's a ham sandwich. And a good one. Yeah, it's good. That's good, boy. Let's try this um, summer thing. Summer jelly thing here. Oh, 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 it's liquidy. There's liquid, hold on. There's some juice. I thought it was like 100% jello-ish, right? You, I don't know if you can see this or not. But it's like jello-y. See, there's like some gel and it's like some liquid. It tastes orange. Mmm. You see that? I know it looks crazy. It looks a little funny looking. It looks, oh! It looks a little funny looking, but let me see what this fruit is down here. If I can make this out. It's delicious, y'all. It tastes much better than the stuff we got back at home. And there's a little piece of, like, fruit something rolling around in here. 
I don't know, but I'm going to find out. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but it's good. Maybe a pineapple? It's got like the texture of a pineapple, but the taste of like a melon, a dull melon, not like a super flavorful one. Mm. All right. I'm saving my noodle salad for later along with my rice balls. I've had these before. Um, on the another video that I'm gonna put up before this one, I tried both of these. Oh, actually, that wasn't a video, was it? That was a live stream. Dog, so I should try it now for you so you can, no, I'm not gonna eat it now. I'm full. You know what I'm saying? So I got too much stuff. Okay, I'll tell you what, it's got to be a part two. Follow and like for more.